by Vincent Ujumadu Orca and Ambra State Government and the Opposition All Progressives Congress APC, in the state Thursday traded words over the planned replacement of the banned commercial motorcycle with 1,000 shuttle buses to be imported soon. While APC described as laughable, Governor Willio Biano's recent trip abroad just for the purposes of importing tricycles into the state to replace motorcycles that were banned in Orca and Anitsha with effect from July 1, 2018, the state government countered saying the party was only suffering from combative ignorance. APC spokesman, Mr. Igbo Eliarines had argued that the state government ought to have contracted the supply of the shuttle buses to an Osan motor manufacturing company, Naui, alleging that the governor's visit to Austria with the intention of getting foreign coupling companies to produce tricycles beat people's imagination. With the impromptu ban on the use of a card by the present government of an Amber state without giving any consideration to the plight of the people who have indeed suffered increased hardship following the Ban, the APC condemns such an action and does not not buy into the bourgeoisie reasons offered by this administration in its deliberate attempts to impose hardship on the people. APC said. But the Inambra State Commissioner for Information and Public Enlightenment, Mr. C. Don Adenuba described APC's position on the matter as a combative ignorance trumpeting its own values. According to the Commissioner, Obiano's trip to Austria was on the invitation of the Nigerian ambassador to Austria, Mrs. SNC Akeke of a business opportunities in the country, especially on waste management. He said, I do not know why some people are this naive and ignorant. In the first place, the governor did not say he would replace banned motorcycles with tricycles. He said he would replace them with shuttle buses. In the second place, Anosan does not manufacture tricycles and that is why I said APC's reaction was a combative ignorance. Obiano is the highest purchaser of Anosan motors as the governor had within a week, or ordered 100 pickup vans from Anosan and 40 of such vehicles had been received and distributed to security agencies in the state.